оружие. Спасибо, так спасибо. Now that main stalker mask is the Soviet PBF, but it actually has cheek filters in reality, as you can see here. Not a um sort of 240 millimeters in either side. As far as I'm aware, there'd be no way of actually rigging it up to take those because the section's obviously built for cheek filters and these screws go into the cheek filters themselves, not the mask. But as you can see from the face piece, it's pretty much identical, just minus the 40 millimeter filters from the in-game gas mask. And we can see from looking at this mask in the game sort of portraits and pictures that there's several variants. There's an old version with a visor and a half version attached to an air oxygen tank. Now the exoskeleton mask appears to be an S10, because all this looks the same, except it's got two filters on each side. Now with an S10, you can't put a filter on that side, on the right side of the mask, because it's designed to shoulder your rifle, you know, right-handed, so the filter just goes on the left. However, the SF10 variant of the S10 lets you have dual filters, so the one stalker's probably an SF10 if they haven't just decided that this mask would look cool with two filters on it. Another one of the masks used in the game is clearly the US XM40, which is the prototype for the M40 mask. I don't have one in my collection, so this picture was taken from the gas mask wiki. Now in some mods you get a GP5. In the video we just saw it was attached to a hose, which was attached to an air canister. Sort of like in a self-contained breathing apparatus setup. But uh, in reality, the GP5 just takes 40mm filters. <laughs> 